you can make fiber boards to build houses, you could make the materials that I'm sitting on on this couch. Everything from plastic to dynamite can come from this plant, the fibers. This attack today on our brother Rich Lee was not just an attack on him, on one person or one organization, it was an attack on every single medical cannabis patient in the state of California and the country of the United States. These are the people that have created safe access for you and they will continue to create safe access for you. There are some very powerful forces in this country who don't want cannabis, including medical cannabis, to be made illegal and they will lash out with the resources that they still have to try to promote their corrupt, failed policies. It's not that cannabis is a drug, it's that hemp is an oil. You've had a tremendous amount of competition going on in the early 20th century uh, with new corporations and companies bringing on the Dow Chemicals and Nylon. And um, I think that they kind of like basically got together and said, <laughs> Um, okay, hemp is threatening both of our industries. It's uh, striking how people don't recognize that cannabis prohibition has been equally ineffective and be counterproductive to the goals of our society. And since that time, it's only continued to get worse. But you look at what's going on in your own courtroom, where we're churning low-level drug offenders through the system for no good purpose. And we have um, taken away a what could be an economical boom a boom for our economy and farmers and made it completely illegal so that we have to import it from China. It is a fact that to this day the boots issued at West Point Military Academy are sewn with hemp and thread rather than cotton because hemp lasts ten times longer than cotton does.